Ow! Babe! Oh, my mom, the drug that my mom is taking. This one that is painful. Like, what do I do now? Baby. I village people. Ah! I just want to have told them that I am engaged to. Hey guys, this is your girl Chamaka Ugo, Asa Odogu One. So guys, I'm here today with Ben. Mr. Ben, you're welcome. You, so Mr. You. Ben just came back from Malaysia. Anyways, guys, I will let him explain to you guys what we want to do today. So <laughs> Ben, I'm just <laughs> Okay, um, like you heard I I based in Malaysia. Mm -hmm. This is this guy I'm dating. I've been dating for like three years now. Uh, last year in December i came and engaged her she's a girl i really love like she mean everything to me yeah. you know but i want to test her to know if she can really stay with me you know this marriage of thing you are talking about is forever for for better for, for, better better for us thank you, you. for exactly so in, in addition to that if you are marrying somebody you have to be convinced that this person can stay with you for better and for worse so i i called her here so i will come with this plan because ever since we made i've been the one catering for all her family like her family her mother her parents her siblings and i think two of our siblings are in an institution which i'm sponsoring them i even built a house at, they have not finished the house so we come up with this plan as of two weeks my friend called like when she called my friend to her that i was arrested with drugs because of the the plan she came up with so to be convinced like to prefer our plans if truly she will be there for me so that's how that's why we are here today okay so guys uh he i think he chats me up on facebook like three weeks ago like few days later we talked she told uh, he told me of his plans or something so i now told him okay let's come up with a plan let's tell this girl that you are arrested with drugs let's like put one or two things on top and see okay is she going to pass in as much as i believe that she will pass I but so. <laughs> but guys we still need to test her yeah, like he really sure. wants to know is she with uh, uh with him for what Love he can yeah, yeah for what he can do for her and her family or does she really love him so guys we'll find out in a moment so <laughs> we're going to ben's house now i've called the girl to come i'm ben's cousin so she said she will be with us in one hour time so wait she will be with me because i told her to come that i have a surprise for her that ben just came back last night she was like <laughs> that she's coming she will be with us in one hour time so guys uh we are in ben's house now we're waiting for his fiance <laughs> so she called uh, a while ago she said she will be here shortly we're still waiting she said one hour before and we've been waiting now for over one hour but she said she's she's coming so oh god i can't wait to see her well i know she will i know she wants to why is her heart beating i don't want to lose this game you won't lose that ah uh, if you, if mine no carry if your mind no carry i'm <laughs> Make me leave this thing. Make no, I go no, my no. house. We really need to do it because I need to be convinced that this girl really loves me. For better, for worse. Yes, I just, I just want to be sure if maybe she just pretending to love me because of the benefit and all that. Ah, <sighs> God. Hey. It's okay, guys. Uh, we are waiting. Okay, so stay tuned, guys. <laughs> so, guys. Um, Ben's uh, girlfriend, fiance. Yeah. <laughs> okay, sorry. Ben's fiance just got here. She's at the gate, so I want to go and open the gate for her. So, Mr. Man, this is your last chance to call this off because... I'm game. I'm game. You're game? Yeah. So, you can test whatever outcome that, that, that we see. The Lord is my strength. <laughs> please don't come and be disturbing me every night, Mark. Please, I love this girl. I can't believe she can do that. Please, let me open the gate for her. This thing, go and hide. Go. Hide well. Make this girl no see you. So guys, let me go and open the gate. Hi. Hi. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Welcome. My friend is calling at home. 
yes when you came last last year i had you were here for one month yes, but yes, yes. i was not around you ah, all right please where is, is he around like yeah he came back hey! Problem, like there's no. This, this hey. they brought him. They brought him back like this last night. Last night, his friends. They said, you know, you know of the issue he had. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I heard. I heard, but. So they said the law in Malaysia is if they if they arrested anybody and you were caught with drugs that they will inject the person before deporting the person. What? Yeah. Like. Yeah. So they said inject. They, they injected him with some substance and deported him to his friends because I don't know. This, this is what I've been battling since last night. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Babe. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my goodness. This was. Oh god, what do I do? Oh God, they like, like there's no solution to this. It's like, I don't know. They say there's no, they brought it back. Like, oh God, someone I waited for for how many years? They like, oh, what do I do? Like, oh, my siblings, so oh, my siblings, my siblings, what do I do? Is the one sponsoring my, my, my sisters in school. Even my mom, the drug that my mom is taking. This one that is paying for, like, what do I do now? What do I do, babe? Babe, like, how did you even get to this? I don't know, I don't know. As in, eh? And I can't call his mother oh. because I, I don't want his mother to see him in this condition. He's been like this since mm. last night, too. Oh. <laughs> His mother to see him like this because I know she would die because he's, he's in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> what do I do? He didn't even complete it. He didn't, and he told me, You told me you will. See, you're just talking. Can we talk about how to find a solution for him? But you're just talking about all the benefits you are getting from him. Are they more important than him? Okay, what do we do? Like, I'm sorry. So what do we do? Hey. Okay, there's someone, I called someone, they said there's no, there's no solution to this. Ah. But I called someone, they said it will get better with time. But I called someone, they gave me a doctor's number. I've called the doctor. <laughs> I've called the doctor. So the doctor said, I should bring him tomorrow. So, but I said, okay, maybe when you come today, we'll, we'll okay. talk on how to do it. I okay. this issue two weeks ago. He, he was telling me that uh, house is building for you, that he sent to me now. But uh, he told you what to do with it, the things to buy with it, and this issue now happened. So, I don't know, maybe you'll bring the money so that we'll use it for, we'll use it to go to the doctor tomorrow, okay? <sighs> That money, that money, you know, he, he sent it for us to use and complete that house that I, I just told you. And because of the rain last week, we did not even buy anything. You know, you cannot do anything under the rain. And I intend using it to, to complete the house. My mother is even currently homeless. And even the money he sent will not even be enough for what's remaining. That's why I'm even, I'm even at broken. I, I don't know what I will do. Yes, but you know now, you know the house can wait for him. He needs more urgent, he needs more urgent uh, solution than the house. Can, is the house more important than him? <laughs> what about the brother now? The brother that normally call him all the time. He used to send out one money when he was in Malaysia. The brother, yeah, the brother just left now to get some food for him. The brother doesn't have any money. It's only ah. no money. And you know him too. We cannot assess his bank now. We can't use his card. He, yeah, we saw his ATM card, but we cannot use it because we don't know the pin. Do you know his pin? I don't know. I don't know. Okay. I don't even know. Maybe I wouldn't even have been this worried. I don't know. 
pay. Yeah, but you need to bring the money. You need to bring the um, money. You've not bought money. Have you bought the item? I'm not bought. I'm, 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 I have plans for this, ma'am. Please. No, but no we, money. Yeah, you need to bring it so that we use it to know if we can find any solution. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that tomorrow. When when is the doctor appointment going? Like, what time is is the doctor's it's appointment? In the morning now. <laughs> oh my God, Sunne, please, we need that money because that was even part of the reason I called you. Because I, as you see me now, I don't have any money. If not, I wouldn't be asking you about it. <laughs> that money. That money. I'm oh, sorry, ma. I cannot release that money. Yo. Even my house rent has expired. And my mother now is currently homeless. And we are expecting to buy things for the house with the money. Even my husband he said he will pay it. And this thing now happened. So, but he's, oh, more important. Now, he's more important than all these things you're mentioning now. He, was he not the person that been catering everything for you? Uh, I understand, but see as how everything has turned out. See how everything has turned out. Eh? See how if if okay, if I bring the money now and then they use it to treat him and maybe I'm not praying, you know, I'm not praying that it should go like that, or oh, and maybe maybe something didn't go right. That's I will be left stranded now and my mother is homeless. Eh? Oh wow. Oh, no. Oh God! Oh God! Babe! 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 Oh God! So I... all these things will not solve anything. You need to get the money. You need to come tomorrow morning. Let's take him to the hospital and see if the doctor can help us with anything. It's okay. Let me... Yeah? Okay. So, you're coming tomorrow morning with the money, okay? No. Okay, that tomorrow morning, there's this job that I applied. I didn't even intend on going because he promised he will send me four million this week. So I didn't even intend on going. But the way things turned out now, I need to go to that interview. Let me see if I will get it and then let's see if anything good will come out of it, ma. But that's for that money. Ma, please. So the money is more important than a man who has been there for you for three years. No, 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 that's not what I'm saying. But let's check out the reality part of it. If the money comes out to him and then nothing works, everything is back to the way it was. Babe. No, uh, babe, this is serious. <laughs> so you're saying this is serious. Why not bring the money? Let's go to the hospital. Let's go and see the doctor and try our luck. Maybe it will work out. You've, we've not even gone to see the doctor. You're already saying what if it doesn't work out? Are you saying it doesn't work out? My sisters. Hmm? Did they say that this thing can be reversed? Like? Yes, they said they, I don't know. The doctor did not guarantee us, but he said he wants to see him first. Um, no guarantee. Ah. No. That money. I'm not sure it will work, Oma. Don't be angry. Don't be angry, Are you Okay, what, call the mother. He used to send money to the mother when he was in Malaysia. He even used to send me the receipt, some of it, that he sent money to. Call the mother, and the mother will, will have money for them to take him there tomorrow. So what do you want me to call the mom? I don't want to tell his mom his situation now till he, 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 he gets a little better. So how do you want me to tell his mom that his son, his first son, the only hope of the family, that how do you want me to tell the mom? Uh, how? How will I tell the mom? Oh, this thing is not supposed to be hard. Oh, You're making things hard. Uh, You're making things hard. This man is building. Is he not the person that is building? The, he told me everything. You know, he's my closest cousin. I know everything. Okay. The three bedroom bungalow he's building for you people. And he just started itself. So bring the money now. It's hard for you. Let's look at it this way. How oh, do if we try to tell the mother, okay, let's not tell the mother that it's to this extent, like, that so, is this So, serious. what will I tell the mother to send me money? Maybe he's sick, just normal sickness that he needs to be operated or something. Instead of it to bring the money that this man gave you, are you serious? 
Oh, my village people. My village people. Ah. I shouldn't have told them that I am engaged to. Oh, I shouldn't have told them. I shouldn't have told them that I am engaged. Oh, man. Man, all these things will not solve anything. Okay, man, let's do it. Let's do it this way. Ah, okay, let me go to this job interview tomorrow. If it comes out, it's a very good offer. Then I know that there's a. Look at me. It was my so you want to go dinner. to interview and wait till the job calls you back before you know if you will bring back the money or not. Are you serious? Are you serious? <laughs> that money, ma. See, if you have money a, if you have account, the money is in my account and. Next week like this, I've already called someone that will take care of the house that he sent to the money. That's even why he sent the money. So, I but now look at his condition. It's more important and you don't want to bring out the money. Are you kidding me? I understand, man. Sorry, man. I, I cannot bring that money. I cannot. I cannot. Sorry, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. No, you don't want him to be fine. If you want him to be, if you want him to be fine, you will bring the money. Do you know what I've been suffering since last night? Maybe you will no. stay with him this night. Maybe you no, understand. No, 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 no. You know the interview. I need to go and prepare. Are you serious? But last December you was around. You were here for one month. Now you cannot stay with him for just one night. You were here for one month. It's not the way you are taking it. It's not the way you are taking it. Hey. I love your cousin, and he knows. He knows, but the way things have turned out now, I need to go, I need to be there tomorrow so that if anything comes out, it's even for his own benefit. Eh? Babe, you'll be fine, okay? You'll be <laughs> Oh, God. See, this, uh, this cry, it will not help anything. Please. Let's let's find a solution. I intend to tell the mom when I know I've done what I'm supposed to do. The mom, you know, she's hypertensive. She's hypertensive. If she sees his her son in this condition, she will just die. And I don't want that. It's when okay. Let's take him to that hospital. If he does, he gave he engaged you. He left everything he has been doing for you. Bring common two million naira he sent to you. The house is more important than his condition. Is it fair? Is it fair? That two million is the only money I have in my Okay, if I bring it down and it doesn't work, where does that leave me? Where 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 do I go to? That's the last money I have. Ask him, that's even the last money he sent to me. What do I do? And this, okay, look at, look at, he's even serious. He's, he's, he's even serious. See, every year, see, look at his body. What's even the guarantee that after I give that money that everything will go back to normal? Mama, don't be angry, oh, I, I can't. I can't. My mother there, my siblings, me. Ah, no, no, no. He will be fine, he will be fine. Ah, he will be fine. Let me just go and prepare for the interview tomorrow. Are you serious? I will, I will keep calling time with that number to know how it is going. Are you serious? Babe. Ma, ma, looking at everything now, that job is, is important. It's important. I didn't even intend it's to It's important that you cannot leave tomorrow. You cannot bring the money. You cannot forfeit tomorrow. Let's take him to the hospital. I'm not saying I cannot come tomorrow. For that tomorrow morning is, is what the problem is. I need to go to work first. The job interview is more important than, than your fiancé. Ma, you'll be fine. But you are here with him now. Eh? You are here. You'll be here and he'll be fine with you. I must not be here for him to be taken care of now. For when, all, yeah? the, all the while he's been coming back, he'll just come back, he'll pack your things and come stay here with him. But now you can't stay again. It was not like this that I then. I'm not saying he's in a bad state too. Like I'm not saying I'm denying him, but ah, well, in your care you will be fine. Let me just go to the job interview, babe. Babe, you'll be fine. Ah, ma, please. Let me just go. I will call you tomorrow to see how it goes. I'll call you, please. So you won't bring the money. Ah, ma, that money party. Ah, sorry. I cannot. I cannot. 
My family is at stake with that money. That's been my last hope. Sorry. Let me just go to the interview and that is calm. Eh? I will call you. Please. Please. Eh? Eh? You'll be fine, okay? Please, I will call you. Maybe ah. I won't keep my back. Ah. Babe. You'll be fine, okay? Stand up, stand up. She left. <sighs> ah, this is terrible. Ah, me, I, me, I, the beg, make, make, uh, made them forgive the girls. But you see this one. If you go back to this girl, uh, even if you think I would not know or something, but if you go back to this girl, you're digging your grave. <sighs> if you go back to her, you're digging your grave. You should they know show that. Showing me the color, like the kind of person she is. To bring the money. Since she, she has job interview. No, be this girl you tell me say where last year you and I'm stay for how long? When you came, the last time you came. Ah. Now she's going for job interview. Oh God, this girl shocked me. This girl broken my eyes. Ah. After I she said it all, this girl. The reason I've been going for her is for the sake of love. I have I beg, make I the hear, make my audience the hear you were said, Mister Lover Boy. You say what did happen? What I've been doing for this girl? For the sake of love I have for her. I never knew she loved me because of my money. I can see she loved my money, not me. But Ma, what do you advise? I sincerely love this girl. <sighs> so this girl cannot stand by me. You can like it's, it's really, really, really so painful. And I don't think I can easily for, for, for forget her. She has a very big vacuum in my heart, like. Ha, vacuum. Psst. I don't understand. I don't know, whatever the decision is yours, sir. You are an adult. But, but I advise people if you know you cannot handle the outcome of. If you know you can't <sighs> handle the outcome, so why, why want to try the person in the first place? Yes, ma, like I told you earlier, you know, you don't just go ahead and marry somebody because she's proclaiming she loves you. Can, can you. can you just you can just see what happened here? That's mean if truly I was ill, this is how she would have left me. Even my money that she have, she cannot bring out my money to look for a way if I can be fine or not. Ah, God, God, why? I think I need some rest. Like, do you have free right now? I, I it's okay, just go inside and rest, okay? <sighs> I'll talk to you later, okay? <sighs> I'm so sorry. <sighs> <sighs>